So Google is secretly working on a new operating system called Fusa. But there hasn't been an official announcement from Google itself. They've started working on it in 2016, around September. So we are in the confusion that what is the purpose of Fusa OS? And on which devices will it be deployed? And mainly, will Fusa replace Android and Chrome OS? To know about this, we have to wait for the official announcement. So before that, here are the 5 things which you need to know about the Fusia OS. Mesentop, a medium sized micro kernel. For the Fusia OS, Google has moved from Linux kernel to the Mesentop kernel. Mesentop is designed for modern phones and PCs with fast processor and with more RAM. And the Mesenta kernel is built around the little kernel which is 24 kilobytes in size in some bootloaders. So Fusia will also run on wearable gadgets. For the Fusia OS, Google was using Dart programming language. Dart is basically a multi-purpose programming language and it is used to build web apps as well as mobile apps. Apps for the Fusia OS can be built by Flutter. By using the Flutter framework, you can write apps for both iOS and Android from a single code base. Now, basically, the Flutter apps were written using the Dart programming language. According to some reports by Android Police, Fuchsia will be combining with Azure with OpenGL. It features volumetric soft shadows, color bleeding, light diffusion and lens effects. So this will definitely improve the graphics quality to a new level. It seems Google was quite interested in offering great graphics on the software side. So if you don't know what Armadillo is, it is the name of the UI which you are seeing right now. Armadillo is built around a card based system for managing applications. There is a central card with profile picture, date, city, name and battery icon. The UI also includes some Google assertions. So the home screen is basically just a vertically scrolling list of cards. So finally, we don't know what exactly Google will do with Fuchsia. We need to wait for that. Google ID show is around the corner, so yeah, we can expect that. But one thing is for sure, it will be big. This is Rohit Verma signing off. Peace.